Hey, it's Derek with The Healthy Trucker, and welcome to Trucker Tough Reviews. Why is a cooler important to a truck driver? Well, when you're out on the road for an extended period of time, driving for hours and hours each day, it's really nice if you can plan ahead and have some meals that are available to you. Um, the trucking industry isn't exactly known for great health, and oftentimes if you don't have a cooler and you aren't thinking ahead, it's going to lead to unhealthy choices, but also choices that can cost you a lot of money. If you have a cooler available, you can plan ahead, you can buy some things in bulk, and you can save a lot of money, but also make very healthy choices. The Cooltron Compact Cooler comes in at around $100 to $110 and is a great value for any truck driver wanting to bring meals with them out on the road. Just to give you a look inside of ours. So we've got yogurt, several cups of this in here. We've got carrots, three apples, a salad, which is a perfect example of something that you can prepackage ahead of time, have as a snack or alongside your meal out on the road. And looking down in here, we also have a couple bottles of water, a wrap, and four different sandwiches. So this is an item that truck drivers definitely want to pick up. It's going to save you money. It's going to save you time. You're not going to have to stop to get these things. But also, most importantly, you're going to eat much healthier. The Cooltron 12 volt compact cooler is a very versatile cooler and that not only provides cooling but also warming capabilities for your food. It can cool to 40 degrees below the outside temperature that's being stored in and it can warm up to 135 degrees. It can take up to 12 hours to get from that warming phase to the cooling phase so keep that in mind as you're thinking about the food that you want to store in it. It's really simple to switch from cooling to warming mode with the Cooltron Compact Cooler. I'll show you how it's done. Just take the plug that you have right here and you can see it's clearly labeled with a red dot and a blue dot for either warm or cold. And whichever you'd prefer, you just simply match the arrow up so it's pointing to that. To make the switch, you simply unplug and change it and that would change it from cooling to warming. One thing to keep in mind is as you go from the cooling to warming mode, there are some aluminum fins in there that do heat up rather quickly, so you're not going to want to touch those. The manual warns not to keep the cooler in warming mode for longer than 45 minutes because it may risk damaging the unit. Head on over to the Healthy Trucker website to see what some other drivers had to say about the Coolatron cooler and to get the complete buyer's guide with all the pros and cons.